Hello, my YouTube friend, Pop Comics here, and today we have probably one of the biggest, most epic online dollar bin purchase ever. <laughs> this is a kind of insane amount of comic books I bought. Uh, so my friend Alex messaged me over a month ago, and he told me things from another world that was having another one of their online dollar sales. And last time I bought about 300 books, and I had so much fun, and I thought I got a lot of really awesome books Lots of stuff from artists I love and just really cool covers. Stuff up the $10 cover price for a dollar. So after that, I was like, you know what? The next time they have that sale, I'm just going to go crazy because I had so much fun. So I did. I think I bought like 900 comic books. <laughs> well, it's seven short boxes full without bags and boards. So it's probably, it might even be a thousand plus. I'm not sure. It's a lot of comic books. So we're going to have a lot of boxes like this to go through today. All right, let's start digging. Let's dig through box number one. Okay, so to start off, we have a couple of these Dead Earth Wonder Womans from Daniel Warren Johnson. Really enjoy his artwork, and I just think these books look amazing. So a buck a piece for book four, and uh, I guess a variant to book four. That is amazing. I'm gonna push these to the side a little bit. All right, so the first handful after those bigger guys. Uh, okay, we have... Fortnite number five, one of the variants. Absolute Rubicon number one. I thought that was a really cool cover, like the black and white with the blue. And that's the cool thing is when you can buy stuff for a dollar, like newer releases, you can buy a lot of these kind of oddball stuff that maybe you wouldn't buy normally for a cover price, but at a dollar, just like you can just enjoy it. Thought that was really cool. And then we have uh, Carnage, Black, White, and Blood variant, the Gleason variant. That is super cool. Uh, Catwoman number 30. That is awesome. All right, Catwoman 32, Jenny Friesen cover for a dollar. I'd buy these all day long. I'd buy multiples, actually. Uh, Catwoman annual number, I guess just the 2021 annual, $7 cover price. So getting that for a dollar was amazing. Uh, Chris Cremont anniversary special number one. I think that was a fun looking comic book. Uh, and then one variant, I really like the artwork on this cover. I think it's a beautiful cover. And a different variant to number one. Uh, the Cimarron Iron something something in the moon. <laughs> Beautiful cover. Uh, Commanders in Crisis number nine. Commanders in Crisis number nine. Different variant. Beautiful cover. Uh, wow, that cover is awesome. What is that? Crossover number six. Love that cover. That cover is great. Uh, Deceased Dead Planet number seven. Deadly Class 45, really adorable cover. Love that cover. I think it's cute. Uh, Demon Days Miracle, number one, an awesome Peach Momoko cover. Peach Momoko for a dollar, I'll buy it any day. Uh, Demon Days Miracle, number one, a variant. And this is cool because I was able to get all the variants. I think I only had the Peach Momoko covers, so getting all the variants to our series is really cool. Uh, J. Scott Campbell variant, number one, for a dollar. Uh, Stan Sakai. For a dollar, that's cool. Detective 1037, that's awesome work of art. That's an awesome cover. Uh, Detective 1038, that's also an awesome cover. And, you know, cover price is $6, so being able to get that for a dollar is pretty awesome. Well, I'm going to have a lot of fun with this haul. Because there's just so many new... I think the artwork in the last year or two on comic books, there's just so many great covers. I feel like uh, just... It's such a joy. We're being really rewarded lately with all these amazing covers. They're expensive though, so it's kind of hard to keep up. But the thing is, when you can buy them for a dollar, you can really catch up on a lot of really cool comic books. Uh, Iniac, what number is that? Number two, I think. Yeah, number two. That's cool. And then uh, number three, Fantastic Four, number 24, Arthur Adams cover. That is awesome. Love that cover. Love Arthur Adams. Fantastic Four, number 30, an awesome uh, Mark Brooks cover. Fantastic Four, number 30, variant edition. I guess it's a uh, Man-Thing variant. Fantastic Four, number 32, Mark Brooks cover. Love that cover. Uh, number 32, Awesome Peach from Mogul cover, which I really wanted. So for a dollar, I feel like I really scored on that. Uh, Far Sector, number 12, uh, Jen Bartel cover. That's gorgeous. I'm like, There's a lot of artists here that I really love. Being able to get these for a dollar. This would, like, imagine going into a comic shop and all these were in a dollar bin. You wouldn't think you just scored. Like, just one of the greatest hauls ever. Uh, Future State Gotham, number one. That cover's awesome. 
Uh, Future State Gotham number two, a Derek Two cover. Love his artwork. It's always fun. Uh, Suicide Squad number two. I saw it was a really cool piece maker cover with the reflection. Love that. Future State Suicide Squad number two, another Derek Two cover. That's awesome. Future State Superman Metropolis number one, Lee and Huke artwork. $7 cover price. A dollar was awesome on that. Uh, Superman Wonder Woman number one. Uh, Future State Wonder Woman number one. That's a fun cover. Uh, Future State number one. The cool red X cover. Love that one. Wow, these are awesome. Okay, next stack here. We have Die 17. That's a cool cover. Cool series. Uh, Future State, the next Batman number two. Beautiful cover. Uh, Geiger number one. That is cool. I think that's a third print, I believe. Uh, Carnage Black, White, and Blood, number one. I guess I got a duplicate of that, I think. Uh, Carnage Black, White, and Blood, number one. Shopping with this, it was the same thing happened this time as last time. Is everything was so laggy that I ended up getting a lot of duplicates. I pulled them out already to put in my shop. But uh, it's just one of those things where at a dollar and like things were selling out and was, I just wanted to place the order. I'd try to get to 100 issues, place the order, get to another issue, place the order, etc. Uh, Captain America number 27. Uh, Kanto number one or Kanto and the City of Giants number one. Buffy the Vampire Slayer number 24. I just thought that was a really cool cover. really like that one. Uh, a fine art variant or a pop art variant of a Black Panther cover. That's cool. I think I actually ended up grabbing two of each of these. So there should be more somewhere because I want to get a set for my friend Sean. I'm supposed to trade him for He had like the rare one from the set and he was going to trade me that. And I was going to trade him like the four or five that I got. Uh, okay, another really cool Black Panther cover. These are really fun. Really like these Black Panther covers. They're all like homages to different famous artists. Love that. Yeah, these are cool. Really love these a lot. Such a fun set of issues. Uh, okay, we have Black Cat number four. Really cute cover. I like the kind of cartoony, cutesy cover. Uh, Batman the Joker Warzone number one. Really cool Derek Chu cover. Uh, Batman the Adventures Continue Season 2 number one. That's a fun cover. I really like that cover. I feel like I missed out on a lot of these covers because like when I was looking at them, I was like, I didn't see that cover before. I had that reaction a lot. Uh, Action Comics 1032, awesome cover. Uh, Action Comics 1032, a variant. Uh, Agrisuko, Meet Her World, number three. Uh, number three again. So one of those is a variant. Uh, Amazing Spider-Man, number 61, this fun variant. I love that. Uh, number 62... Ascender number 16. Batman 108. Okay, I'm going to clear these out because this is getting a little bit full over. Okay, next stack. Uh, we have Batman 108. A really awesome art term cover. I think that's her first appearance. I forget. A uh, Batman 109. A beautiful variant cover. Uh, Batman 109. Awesome Jen Bartel cover. Love that cover. Gorgeous. Batman Black and White number four. That cover is amazing. Wow, these are just... This is so much fun. So many great covers. Batman Catwoman number four. Uh, Fortnite Zero Point number five. Amanda Connor cover. Fortnite Zero Point number three. Uh, Venom 200. Really cool cover. And a dollar for a $10 retail comic. That's amazing to me. Venom number 35. Variant again. $10 cover price. Uh, Venom 35, another variant, the Gleason variant, $10 cover price. So for a dollar, these are all amazing. I really scored on those. Uh, Venom number 34. Love the artwork. Is that James Stokey? Uh, colorist, letters, cover artist. Not familiar with the cover artist, but I think that's really cool looking. Um, another Venom. So there's all these different variants, the Venom 35 for a buck a piece. Those are kind of amazing. Love all those. A uh, Voyage to the Stars number four. That's a cool looking comic book. Really like that. Uh, Warhammer forty thousand. That looks like a James Stokey cover. I gotta double check that. Uh, no, I'm not sure. I'm not familiar with the 
artist. It looks like James Tokyo is a different artist. That's such a cool looking cover though. And then uh, Warhammer number five. Beautiful covers. Love those a lot. Just really detailed and they look cool. Lots going on. Okay, next stack. I'm going to move these over just a little bit. So I have a little bit more room to dig through the stack. Okay, we have Way of X number two variant. Uh, just a really awesome looking Black Widow cover. I kind of like that design. Widowmakers, Red Guardian, and Yelena Belova number one variant. Okay, that's a really cool cover. A uh, Wolverine Black, White, and Blood. I love all these Black, White, and Blood issues they've done with the Black, White, and Red colors. Gorgeous comic book. Uh, Woman of Marvel number one. Awesome cover. Woman of Marvel number one. Variant Amanda Connor cover. I love that. A uh, Woman of Marvel number one. That cover is absolutely gorgeous to me. And then I think the interior has a lot of great different artists. Like that page is gorgeous. Love that page. Just the watercolors and everything. And uh, just, I guess it's just a anthology with a bunch of different artists. But yeah, for Buck, that's an amazing comic book. Uh, Wonder Woman 759. Love my Wonder Woman comic books. Wonder Woman 763. So catching up with a lot of issues from last year. 774. A uh, Wonder Woman Black and Gold number one. Awesome Jen Bartel cover. I still need to get the Rose Bish cover from this series. It's so expensive though. Uh, different version of number one. I think this is Joshua Middleton, I believe. Uh, Wind number seven. That's an awesome cover. Oh, and the interior is really nice too. Yeah, that's... Beautiful artwork. Uh, X-Men, X of Swords, number 11. That's a beautiful cover. I'm going to say that on every issue. I just, I grab stuff based on beautiful covers. I just love cover art. And these all have amazing covers. Uh, X of Swords, number 11. Uh, X-Force, number 19. That's an awesome cover. Uh, X-Men, number 19. Another great cover. X-Men, Curse of the Man-Thing, number 1. Year Zero, Number one, I just really love all like the zombies coming out of there. Okay, that was cool. Very cool little stack there. Okay, next stack we have uh, The Butcher of Paris. That's a cool cover. Uh, Year Zero, issue five. Awesome zombie cover. Love that. Ooh, we have a fun foil cover. That is uh, White Widow, number three. Uh, interior artwork's not as good, but the cover is a lot of fun. Love that. Amazing Spider-Man, number 55, second printing, Gleason cover. Man, that first print when it came out was so hot. Uh, out of Body, number five, really awesome cover. I wonder if the interior is, the interior is pretty all right. Uh, the Orville, number one, love the Orville, so I had to have that. Uh, NYX, number one, this is one of those awesome Ninja Turtle homages that they did. I think they did it for a whole bunch of different issues. Uh, Nightwing, 85, beautiful cover. Nightwing 85, a different variant of it. That's beautiful. Paradise Towers number one. Really like that cover a lot. I thought that was a gorgeous cover. Uh, Purgatory issue two, another Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles homage cover. I thought those were amazing. Uh, Radiant Black issue eight. That's an awesome cover. Uh, New Mutants number 21, beautiful cover. New Mutants number 22, another beautiful cover. Uh, New Mutants number 22 variant, beautiful cover. Mighty Morphin number 11, Lee and Hugh cover. That's gorgeous. Wow, this is so much fun. <laughs> this is like such a treat to get so many wonderful covers at once. Like usually when I pick through dollar bins, I try to grab stuff I really like, but I don't get, like I get stuff I sort of like, but this is just like all top-notch artists. I love it. Sweet Paprika number four. Uh, MFKZ number five. I thought these look cool. Interiors look interesting. That looks really cool. Uh, Masters of the Universe Revelations number four. Beautiful cover. I'm just, I'm, I feel like I'm repeating myself, but these are all just gorgeous covers. Number three, that's gorgeous too. Oh, Voices Identity number one. Awesome Peach Momoko cover. That one I really wanted. With Nico on the cover. Love that one. A uh, Harley Quinn number 75. I'll grab any Harley cover I see. Uh, ha Ha number four. That, that's an awesome Dr. Seuss homage. Love that one. Gung Ho number one. I just love the way he's drawn or painted. And I love the Atari shirt. I would wear a shirt like that. Cool looking cover. 
And this is great. I'm grabbing a lot of these cool indie comic books for a buck, which I love. Uh, Guardians of Galaxy number 12. That's a beautiful cover. Uh, Geiger number 3. Do you want to get all my Geiger issues? I want to put the whole set together, all the different covers. Geiger number 3, different variant. A uh, Geiger number two. This is, I think, one of my favorite covers from the series. I just love the way he's glowing in the dark and you get the moon and gorgeous cover. A uh, Geiger number two. So one of those is a variant. Uh, another Geiger number two. So I got three different variants, four different variants. These are all amazing though. Five different variants. A uh, Geiger number one, fourth print, I believe. Yeah, those are awesome. <laughs> so cool. I probably would have went out of my way and got all of these for cover price, but getting them for a dollar is amazing. Uh, some of these comic books might have been two dollars. I forget, but I, I think the bulk of these are all a dollar. Uh, Silk number four, amazing cover. Uh, Seven Secrets number nine. I thought that was a fun cover. Wonder Woman number three. I do kind of like the selfie covers when they make those. Uh, Scumbag number seven, beautiful painted cover. Uh, Sacred six number ten. Sacred six number ten again, so a different variant. Uh, three different variants. Four different variants. These all have beautiful covers though. Uh, Robin two, love that cover. The artwork is so great. I love all the covers he does. Those are awesome. Uh, Robin 2, a different variant. I think that's the first appearance of that character. Uh, Planet of the Symbiotes, number 2. Okay, I'm going to move these out because we're getting a little bit overloaded again. Okay, last stack from box number 1. You know what? Going through this box, I think this was all dollar ones. Because I know the ones I paid more were like Peach Momoko and kind of like rarer variants. Uh, King and Black Handbook. Don't know the number, but that's a cool looking cover. Uh, Gwenum versus Carnage number three. Gwenum versus Carnage number three, a different variant. Or I think that's the variant regular cover. A uh, King and Black number five. King and Black number five. So one's a variant. A uh, Killadelphia uh, David Mack cover. That one's a gorgeous cover. Carmen number three. Justice League number sixty-three. That's a fun cover. I love how the logo is like just in the dirt there. Uh, Justice League number 60. Jonah and the Unpossible Monsters number 3. That's a cute cover. I really like that one. Oh, and it's cute inside too. Yeah, I love comic books like that. That's great. Uh, the Joker number 4. Awesome cover. Last Witch number 5. This looks like a fun kind of like cartoony. Yeah, that looks really cool. Love that. Uh, Last Witch number 5. So one's a variant. Uh, Scream number one, Lee and Hugh cover, that's gorgeous. Mandrake, the Magician number three. That's a really nice looking cover. That's beautiful. And oh, and the interiors are pretty fun too. Alright, that's cool. Uh, Mandrake, the Magician number four. That's a beautiful cover. Lock and key number zero. Uh oh, and then we have a hidden pain to walker variant. Okay, I'm gonna open it up. I want to see what it looks like. Okay, let's see what we got. It is... Uh, oh, it's uh, Jace. That's a cool looking cover. Really like that a lot, actually. Uh, Magic number three. Do love my Magic the Gathering. And Marvel Action Origins. I love collecting these kind of more cartoony for kid ones. Because I know in the long run, these ones are going to be kind of hard to get. They'll be the ones that the kids get and they get beat up. And then, you know, in uh, 10 years, it'll be hard to find them in decent shape. Okay, so box one was amazing. I had so much fun with that. I, uh, I feel like the next time they have a dollar sale, I'm going to have to go crazy again. <laughs> All right, let's dig through box number two. Okay, this is awesome. We have Nice House on the Lake book four. Come on, for a dollar, that's amazing. We have uh, Superman, Son of Kal-El number five, a Lee and Hugh cover. Love this. This is the one where I believe Superman's son is gay. So this one probably will be a key issue that I'll have value in the future. Uh, Dark Ages, number one, Lee and Hugh cover. Lovely and Hugh stuff. Uh, Batman, 116. That's a fun cover. Uh, Moon Knight, number four. That's a really fun cover. I like that one a lot. Something is Killing the Children, number 20. That's amazing. Batman Urban Legends, number eight. Batman Urban Legends, number eight. Again, these were $8 cover prices, so a dollar is awesome on that. House of Slaughter, number one. Cool 
oil cover. How's the slaughter number one blank variant? I love the blank variants. I, my friend James, I really want him to draw on these for me. A uh, house of slaughter number one. So we have a couple different variants of number one. Ooh, I really like these Echolands. They're just like cool sideways comic books. Number one. Oh, and the artwork looks great inside. Look, look how nice that is. Oh yeah, these are cool. Really happy to get those for a buck. Two different versions of that. I think it's, yeah, it's the same comic inside, different covers. That's awesome. I want to get that full set. Every time I look at the covers, I think they're amazing. Okay, we have Batman the Imposter, uh, book one. Really cool cover. Uh, Trial of Magneto, number three, a beautiful Scarlet Witch cover. Love that one so much. Uh, Trial of Magneto, number three, a beautiful Peach Momoko cover. This is one of my favorite covers she did. Love Magic, love Peach Momoko. Great, just perfect. Uh, X-Men Legends number 7, a fun like old school kind of cartoony look. Old school in 90s, not like old school 80s, 70s. <laughs> I mean, you know, it's vintage, but not like super vintage. x Lives of Wolverine number 1, beautiful Peach Momoko cover. Ooh, yeah, Peach Momoko for a dollar is amazing. A Wonder Woman Black and Gold number 5. Wonder Woman 780. A Wonder Girl number 4, that cover is cool. I really like that one a lot. Uh, Wonder Girl number four. Wonder Girl number three. I love all the covers on this series. I just think they're beautiful. Wonder Girl number three. Uh, Woman of Marvel number one. Awesome Peach Momoko variant. Love that one. That one might have been $2. I forget. Uh, Witch Blood. I uh, don't know the number, but this looks... Oh, it looks cool inside too. That's really fun. I like that one a lot. Uh, Winter Guard number three. Awesome cover. Uh, Winter Guard number one. Next handful. Uh, what's the furthest place from here? Number one. That's a really cool looking cover. I really like that one a lot. Oh, and the artwork's cool too. I like the artwork a lot inside. It just, it's kind of blocky, but the coloring is really nice. I like that's like a record store scene there. Oh yeah, this is great. I kind of want to read that. Uh, what's the furthest place from here? It's got a young variant. That one's gorgeous. Uh, what's the furthest place from here? Number one. So we have a couple different versions of this. Uh, different version of number one. These are all really cool looking. And these are like thick issues. Uh, $5 cover price. That's actually a really thick, nice comic book for five bucks. Uh, we Live number four. That is awesome. I wanna get all the variants that We Live. Uh, I think it's a second printing. We Don't Kill Spiders, number one. That cover is great. Love the coloring. Oh, yeah, that looks cool. Uh, Venom, number one, Lee and Hugh variant. That's awesome. Vengeance of Vampirella, number 23. Looks like a young Angelina Jolie. Probably, the artist probably referenced the old picture. Uh, the interiors are kind of boring, but the cover is awesome. <laughs> uh, Vampirella, The Dark Powers, number one. Gorgeous Beach Momoko cover. Love that one. Ooh, Vampirella number 25, a Rose Bish cover. I was really excited to see, like, I got a lot of Peach Momoko and a lot of Rose Bish covers for a dollar. Uh, Yusugi Jimbo number six for a dollar. That's awesome. I love Stan Sakai stuff, so this is awesome. Number four. Wow, this box. <laughs> this whole dollar bin haul is like one of the greatest dollar hauls I've ever had because I'm having so much fun with this. A uh, number 23. Uh, unbelievable Unteens number three. Absolutely love this cover. I just think it's the coloring and everything about it is awesome. Well, the interiors are pretty cool too. It looks like a couple different artists. That's fun. Sometimes you get covers are awesome and you look inside, it looks like garbage. And sometimes you look inside, and it looks amazing. Uh, Twin Mermaids. I just thought it was a cute cover. I mean, the artwork's not that great. Yeah, interior's not that great either. But for a dollar, why not? <laughs> Some stuff I was just grabbing just because it looked interesting. Turbo Kid number two, that cover is really awesome, actually. Well, and the interiors are fun, too. It's like a, like a gray scale with some red, and just, I like the way it's got the shading. Wow, that's a cool looking comic book. I'm happy I got that. Uh, Turbo Kid number two, so we have a second variant, and it looks like an old beat up, you know, VHS or something. That is cool. I really like those. Uh, Titans United number two, that's a cool looking cover. Interiors are all right. 
Uh, Super Service versus COVID-19. I saw this at uh, Anime Con. A vendor had it for sale last year. And I kind of regretted not picking it up. But now I got it for a dollar. So I'm actually really happy with that. Yeah, that's awesome. Uh, Suicide Squad, King Shark number three. Really cool cover. Love that. Okay, what do we have here? Uh, Suicide Squad, King Shark number two. That cover is really cool. Uh, Symbiote, Spider-Man, Crossroads number three. I mean, any cover with uh, Devil Dinosaur is always awesome. Titans United, number one. Absolutely love this cover. I think the composition is great. It's And, you know, it's one of those covers where all the characters are leaping. And, but a lot of times when artists do this, they just have them kind of like random. But this one has them designed in such a way that they're all at a focal point And you have the T-Tower there. You have the horizon at an angle, so it adds that like a little tension to it. That's a great cover. I love that one so much. Uh, Swamp Thing, number seven. Beautiful cover. Superman and the Authority number three. That's a beautiful cover. A uh, Suicide Squad King Shark number two. Awesome cover. Suicide Squad number seven. A really awesome ambush bug cover. A uh, Suicide Squad number seven. Different version. A uh, Stranger Things one shot cover A. That's a fun cover. A uh, Strange Academy number 17. Awesome Peach Momoko cover. I don't think I remember seeing that cover. That's awesome. Spider-Woman number 20. Another Peach Momoko cover. Love that. This is one of our weaker covers. I think it's weaker when she doesn't do like a full image. But I still really love it. You know, weaker for awesome is still awesome. Uh, Spider-Woman number 16. Okay. Uh, Spider-Woman number 15. Spider-Woman number 15 again. Different variant. Uh, Captain Harlock number five. I actually wanted to get all the different versions of the series, so it's cool I was able to get a bunch for a dollar. Uh, number five. Number, I don't know the number, but it looks like a Indiana Jones homage. Oh, and a Virgin variant for a dollar. Heck yeah. Uh, the Avengers 55 Peach Momoko cover. That is awesome. Avengers number 48. That's a fun cover. I really like that one. Avengers number 46 Peach Momoko cover. Uh, Stranger Things. I don't know the number, but that's cool. Oh, Batgirls number one, a Babs Tar cover. Oh, this is one that I think I actually paid uh, because this is their exclusive. I think I actually paid just whatever the regular price is. So it's like four or five bucks just because I was on a Babs Tar kick and I absolutely love that cover. Uh, Jim Ruggs, Hulk the Grand Design, Peach Momoko. This one I might have actually paid more to. This might have been cover price just because it's also Peach Momoko cover. Yeah. Awesome comic book. Uh, Overwatch, Tracer London Calling. Don't know the number. I believe Bab is hard to... Yeah, she does the interior artwork. So that's super cool. Uh, Star Wars High Republic number 11. That's a fun cover. Okay, I'm going to clear these out because we're getting a little bit full here. Next stack. Ooh, all right. We have this awesome Kang Peach Momoko cover for Stormbreakers. That is cool. Really like that one a lot. A Vampirella number 25, another Ninja Turtles homage cover. These are so cool. Love those. Uh, Pirate Queen, uh, was it number two? That's a cool looking cover. Oh, and the interior is pretty cool too. Yeah, that's cool. I love finding like indie stuff that maybe I just don't normally see. And for a dollar, that's amazing. Okay, we have Masters of the Universe Revelations number four. Fun cover. Uh, Deathstroke Inc. number one. This awesome Adam Hughes cover. This is one of my favorite covers last year. That's an awesome comic book. Uh, Agony number one. Radiant Black number eight. Love that. Uh, Suicide Squad King Shark number one. All these King Shark covers are really nice. Uh, Mortal Hulk number 50. A nice thick issue. What was the cover price on this? Ten bucks. So for a dollar, that's awesome. I was so happy that I was able to get a bunch of Red Room issues for a buck. Because that's awesome. Uh, Dark Side number one. That's an awesome cover. Love that one. Oh, I forget the artist's name that did that. What is his name again? Dan Hip. It's just a really fun, like, it looks like colored pencils. Love that. Uh, nice House on the Lake, book five. Uh, nice House on the Lake, book five. Different variant. Number four variant cover. It's cool to get a few variants from that series. Uh, Harley Quinn, the animated series, number five. Love that. Number six, a Derek Chu cover. That cover is awesome. Love that. Wow, these are cool. All right. Oh, this is a fun sideways Derek Chu cover. I really do love sideways covers. Look how gorgeous that cover is. 
She looks really cute. Okay, uh, Harley Quinn number 75. Harley Quinn number 9. I love all the A and the B covers on this series. I think they're great. Uh, number 10. Some of these are a little bit beat up, but you know what? They're dollar bin. I'm happy, even if they're a little beat up. Just to have them and just enjoy the artwork and to read them and stuff. Amazing. All right, number 11. Uh, number 8, a really cute Dark 2 cover. Love that one. Harley Quinn number 7. Number 8. I think some of these I might have picked up from uh, the comic shop when they're new, but I just, at a dollar, I was just grabbing everything. Harley Quinn number six, that's a cool cover. Harley Quinn number four, love that cover. Yeah, those are fun, very fun. Uh, oh, this is cool. Uh, I love getting stuff like this too, because normally I'm not like a huge Green Arrow fan, but I love Jen Bartel's artwork, so I would have wanted to buy this, but you know, it's a $10 cover price, so I'm just like, ah, I don't want to pay $10. It does have a little bit of damage right there, but it was a dollar, thrilled to have that. Uh, Fantastic Four number 32 Peach Moko cover. I think I grabbed an extra one of those. 8 Billion Genies number 1. I think this one actually... Didn't they just option this show so the prices are going up? So that's super cool that I got one. Corner's a little dent, but I'm okay with that. Awesome uh, Jenny Friesen cover. Love that. Eat the Rich number 1 Jenny Friesen cover. Uh, Die number 19 Jenny Friesen cover. Uh, Demon Days Miracle number 1 variant. Demon Days Miracle number one, J. Scott Campbell variant. Demon Days Miracle number one, another variant. Demon Days Curse Web number one, awesome Jenna Friesen variant. Uh, Champions number eight, a Peach Momoko cover. Demon Days Curse Web number one, Peach Momoko cover. These are awesome. Now, some of these, this stack actually looks like it got damaged. I don't know if it was damaged in shipping. Maybe this box got dinged. But that's okay. You know, I paid a dollar. And uh, maybe they'll have another dollar sale and I'll buy them again if they're damaged. <laughs> uh, the Batman, number 41, an awesome Jenny Freezing cover. Okay, those are super cool. This looks like the order that I probably placed first where I would just look up artists I wanted. So like I would get all the Peach Moko and Jenny Freezing and stuff. That's why it looks like there's a lot of those artists in these stacks. Uh, what is this? This is Blade Runner Origins with a Peach Moko cover. That is super cool. Captain Marvel with Peach Momoko. Uh, Black Widow, Adam Hughes cover. Love the covers on that series. Uh, Black Widow number 10. That's a fun cover. Uh, Black Widow number 10. Mark Brooks cover. Love that cover. That's an awesome cover. Black Widow 13. Awesome Peach Momoko cover. Uh, Black Widow 15. Peach Momoko cover. That's awesome. Black Widow number 8. That's a fun cover. Uh, Black Widow number 9. Adam Hughes cover. This is one of my favorite covers from last year. Awesome cover. Uh, Black Cat, number four. A really cute Jen Bartel cover. Love that one. Uh, Black Cat, number eight. Uh, Peach from Moco cover. Uh, Batman, number five. I think this is a Jenny Friesen cover. Awesome cover. And, you know, $6 cover price, paying a dollar for that. That's awesome. Uh, Alice Ever After, number one. Awesome Jenny Friesen cover. The Amazing Spider-Man, number one. Peach from Moco cover. That's awesome. Uh, Amazing Spider-Man, number 78. Love this cover. Peach from Moco cover. Such a great cover. The Amazing Spider-Man number 85. It's a homage cover. Awesome, awesome, awesome Peach Moko cover. I love that one so much. Wow, this is so much fun. Okay, what do we got here? Okay, we have uh, Arkham City, The Order of the World number four. I think that's a Jen Bartel cover. Yeah, I don't remember seeing that cover before. That cover is beautiful. Oh, wow. Really enjoy that. Okay. Avengers, Tech on Avengers, number three, Peach Momoko cover. Uh, number five, Peach Momoko cover. Number six, Peach Momoko cover. Those are cool. Batman 109, a Jen Bartel Pride cover. That one's gorgeous. Uh, Demon Days, Chris Webb, number one. That's a cool cover. Uh, Demon Days, Miracle, number one, Jen Bartel cover. Love that cover. Uh, Deadpool, Black, White, and Blood, number one. Ah. Uh, yeah, I believe that's a James Stokey cover. That cover is awesome. Uh, Deadpool, Black, White, and Blood, number one. Another beautiful cover. Uh, Super Sense, number four. I really like that cover. I thought that cover was pretty cool. Uh, Catwoman Annual. I think that's a duplicate. Actually, I accidentally bought another one of those. Catwoman Annual 2021. That's a cool cover. Carnage, Black, White, and Blood, number four. Uh, Cult of Dracula, Shannon Mayer cover. That one is awesome. I love that cover. Uh, Crush and Lobo, number two. Amanda Connor cover. That's cute. Uh, Champions, number eight. That's a fun you know, video game cover. Love that. Super Sons, number five. I thought that cover was great. 
Deadpool Black, White, and Blood number one. Another gorgeous cover. I love all the covers on that series. Uh, Daredevil number 32. It's a fun cover. Uh, Captain Marvel number 30. That cover's awesome. Uh, Black Cat number nine. I love how they're like the repeating pattern cover. I thought that was super cool. Uh, Black Cat number eight. That's a fun cover. Uh, Bermuda number two. I just thought this was a really fun cover. I really like all the details and stuff. Okay, awesome. All right, let me clear these out because I'm running out of space. Okay, and then the last handful from this box. We have Bermuda number one. That cover looks fun. Uh, Batman The Adventure Continues number two. That one's fun. Oh, Captain Marvel 31. Lee and Hugh, Miss Marvel cover. Love this one. I think I have this one already, but I still love that cover. Uh, Carnage Black, White, and Blood number four. Future State Gotham number three. That's a cool cover. Freak Snow number four. That cover is fun. Oh, and the interiors are fun too. Oh, that's cool. Love that. Fortnite versus Minecraft. Crap. <laughs> it's a comedy. Uh, Extreme Carnage. Don't see the number, but that's cool. Or I guess it's a Phage comic. Phage number one. That's a cool cover. Okay, so that box was amazing. All right, let's dig through box number three. Okay, this next box looks like it has a little teeny stack of comic book books I must have got from my friend Sean. So we're going to go through those really quick before we get back to the dollar bin stuff. Uh, okay, so we have Strange Adventures number three. That's a cool comic book cover. Uh, Black Panther 30 zombie cover. Miracle Squad number one. Uh, anything goes number three i think that's the back cover though so i'm not sure what that is uh venom number four modern fantasy number one that's a fun cover it looks like it was signed uh jupiter legacy number three signed by frank quietly batman annual number one i think that one has a bit of value oh this is sticking here uh tank girl number three that's cool do like tank girl undiscovered country number one that one is signed uh, Black Panther 170. That looks like, yeah, Noto cover. Uh, Invincible Iron Man number two. Super Sons number six. Love that cover. Beautiful cover. Super Sons number two. Uh, another awesome, beautiful watercolor cover. I love all these, actually. Super Sons number 14. Number 13. Uh, new X-Men number one, 28. I think this is the first appearance of someone. So that one has a little bit of value. Oh, that looks like it was a subscription copy. Okay, and then one more little stack from Sean. Uh, we have Betty and Veronica Jumbo Comic Books, number 80. Superhero Squad, number 9. Uh, oh, one of these junky comic books. I forget what that is. <laughs> Harley Quinn Power Girl, number 2. Mandra Connor artwork. Titans, number 1. Uh, Maelstrom, number 4. That's a cool cover. Uh, free comic book day comic book. Oh, a really nice Detective 412. Love that cover. Awesome comic book. Uh, Amazing Spider-Man 344. This is the first uh, cameo or first appearance of Cletus Cassidy, I believe. Uh, Daredevil, Woman Without Fear, number three. That's a cool cover. Teen Titans, number 12. That's a beautiful cover. Uh, Turtles, number 10. I love getting old Turtles issues. Uh, New Avengers, number seven. This one is, I think, the first Illuminati. So the value of that one jumped with the um, Doctor Strange movie. Ooh, Journey to the Mystery 117. Gorgeous older comic book. Okay, that's awesome. Uh, Strange Adventures number four. Futurama number 41. I have to figure out what issues I still need on the series because I want to finish my Futurama run. Okay, now back to the dollar bin. All right. Let's see what we got here. Okay, we have X Corp. Uh, I'm not sure the number, but it's a fun looking cover. Uh, Wonder Woman 775. Catwoman number 40, a Jenny Friesen cover. Uh, okay, so this is the second set of Black Panther covers. So I did grab a second set here for my friend Sean. And uh, I think, as I said, he's going to trade me like the rare variant from this set for the just the cheap ones. I mean, I paid a dollar, so I got them cheap. Oh, that's a Peach Momoko one, though. That is awesome. Love those. Those are cool. Giant Size Amazing Spider-Man number one. That's cool. Okay, next stack, we have uh, Bounty Hunters 15, David Nakayama variant. Really happy to get that. I wish there was more David Nakayama stuff on the site. I was trying to get other issues, but I got a couple, so I'm happy about that. Uh, Skybound number one, the blank cover variant. Uh, this is the first appearance of Clementine. And, you know, now that 
they're talking about a series, I guess. I'm kind of specking on these. So I grabbed a whole bunch of the blank ones. One, two, three, four. Actually, let me put these together here. Five. So I got five of those, and I gave one to my friend James to draw on for me. Uh, not all robots, number one. That's a cool cover. I like that one a lot. Uh, oh, what is this? Eric Klaus, number one. A really cute cover. Oh, Ninja and Robots. That's what it's called. That one's cute, though. I really like that cover. Uh, Nine Stones, number one. That's a really nice cover. That's a great cover, actually. Uh, New Mutants, number 20. That's a cool cover. Uh, Moths, number two. thought that was a cool cover. And I love uh, J. Michael Straczynski's writing. Oh, the interior is fun. I mean, it looks like they might have just taken photos and, like, used some kind of filter on them. But it just still looks really cool. All right, that's neat. Uh, Sweet Paprika, number one, art drum variant. That is awesome. Uh, MFKZ, number two. Really like the covers on these. Terrier is really nice, too. Uh, this is a different version of Skybound 1 with the first appearance of Clementine. So I actually grabbed a whole stack of those as well. Definitely specking on these. At a buck, it's like such a cheap thing to pay for. And one day, these might be like $30 issues. So I think it's good to invest in stuff like this sometimes. Wonder Woman Black and Gold, number two. That's a beautiful cover. Wind number nine. Uh, X Corp number. Uh, well, don't see the number, but that's a cool cover. Okay, I'm gonna clear these out because this is getting a little bit full. Okay, next stack we have the Trial of Magneto number one variant. Beautiful cover. Uh, Red Room Anti Social Network number uh, 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 number three. Again, I'm really happy that I was able to get a bunch of Red Room issues. Uh, the Witcher number two. The Witcher number two variant. Uh, Eniac four. That's awesome. X Factor number 10 variant. That's awesome. Uh, X Force 21. A really awesome looking, I guess it's Man Thing. Love the cover on that though. I thought that was awesome. Uh, the Trial of Magneto number one. Uh, Art Germ cover. Love that cover. Suicide Squad number five. That's a fun cover. Superman Red and Blue number five. That's cool. Swamp Thing number six. That's an awesome cover. Symbiote Spider Man Crossroads number one. That's a fun cover. Strange Avengers number 11. I really love this cover. I think that's such a great cover. Spider Man Spider Shadow number four. A Noto cover. I love that one. Spider Woman number 13. Uh, Star Wars number 16. Another David Nakayama cover. I love that. Okay. Let's see, we got uh, oh. Yusuke Ujimbo, number 21. Another Stan Sakai comic book. Love that. Number two. Love that, too. Uh, Vampirella, number 21. A Shannon Meyer cover. That one is awesome. Vengeance of Vampirella, number 20. Uh, Walking Dead Deluxe, number 19. An Arthur Adams cover. Love that one. Uh, Way of X, number five. That's a cool cover. I really like that one a lot. Uh, Witcher number two, that's a great cover. Witcher number three. Uh, Witcher number three, love the Witcher. Witcher number three, so a bunch of different variants of that. Wonder Woman 777, a Suicide Squad variant. That one's a ton of fun. Love that one a lot. Uh, Wonder Woman 778, that's a fun cover. Uh, Wonder Woman Black and Gold number two, Terry Dotson cover. Uh, oh, I got a duplicate of that. Okay, I'm going to have to pull out the duplicates for my shop. All right, that's awesome. And like I said, they just, as you're checking out, there's so much lag that uh, I would end up getting multiples of things. Uh, or maybe even ordered it a second time by mistake. Just because, I, you know, it's going through everything and I was trying to find the stuff I wanted. And just the site is laggy. So sometimes you just grab it and then I don't mind because I paid a dollar and an art drum comic book. You can get like four or five pretty easily. Probably should have ordered more, honestly. Uh, Sensational Wonder Woman number six. Six variant. Seven Secrets number 11. That's a fun cover. Silk number four. Love that cover. Uh, Not All Robots number one. That's a cool homage cover. Orcs number six. I love all the covers to this series. Out of Body number two. That's an awesome cover. Out of Body number three. That's also an awesome cover. Power Rangers number eight. I love the blank variants. We can get that drawn on. Uh, Power Rangers number nine. Radiant Black issue seven. Red Room number two. Really happy to get that. Uh, Red Sonia 28, a J. Lee cover. Love that one. Robin 5, love this cover. This is one of my favorite covers from last year. Warshack, I uh, don't know the number, but it's Arthur Adams cover, so that makes me happy. 
Avengers 46 Peach Mocha cover. I believe that's a duplicate. Um, War of the Bounty Hunters number one. Awesome David Nakayama cover. Teen Titans Academy number five. Captain America number one. Beautiful cover. And that's everything in that box. That box was thrilling. That was an awesome box. All right, let's see what's in box number four. Okay. We got uh, Killer Queens number three. That's a cool looking cover. I really like that cover. Uh, Killer Queens three. So it's like an AB variant or C variant. Yeah, AB, C variant. Uh, Wicked and Hulkling number one. Legends of the Dark Knight number five. Legends of the Dark Knight number six. Those are great covers. Uh, Lock and Key Hell and Gone number two. Seven dollar cover price. It's always awesome getting a seven dollar comic book for a buck. And number two, those are great. Uh, and number two, different variant. Uh, Justice League number 67. That's a beautiful cover. Uh, Magic the Gathering number six. That's cool. Love Magic. Uh, different variant of number six and number seven. And oh, we have another one of these uh, hidden variants. Let me open that. Okay, let's see what this looks like. It's uh, uh, a Chandra cover. That's cool. Very cool. Love that. That's actually really neat. All right, next stack we have uh, Marjorie Finnegan, Temporal Criminal. That's cool. That sounds like a cool series. Justice League 68. Uh, Justice League number six. That's a gorgeous cover. Uh, Kang the Conqueror number two. Killer Queens number two, another variant. Uh, the Joker number eight. It's a fun cover. And a variant. That one's gorgeous. The Invincible Red Sonia number five. That's a beautiful cover. Uh, we have number five, a Lisner cover. That's gorgeous. Uh, Inferno number two, Peach Momoko cover. Inferno number two, beautiful cover. Uh, Ice Cream Man number 25. Ice Cream Man, what number is that? Uh, number 25, a different variant. That's a fun cover. Inferno, number one, a Mark Brooks variant. That's a gorgeous cover. Ice Cream Man, number 25. Love this cover. This cover is awesome. Uh, I Am Batman, number two. Uh, Harley Quinn, number eight. Uh, God Killer, number three. That's a gorgeous cover. The Good Asian, number five. Uh, oh, this is cool. So we have... Uh, Gru meets Tarzan, number three. Love Gru. Gru's one of my favorites. You guys know that. Uh, Guardians of the Galaxy, number 18. That's a cool cover. Laura, number three. That's a beautiful cover. I love water covers. Anytime there's a cover where there's like rain or someone's in water, I always think they're great covers. Uh, Hardware Season 1. That's an awesome cover. Harley Quinn, number seven. Geiger, number six. Geiger, number six. So there's an AB variants. Uh, Ghost Rider number one, Peach Momoko cover. That's awesome. Uh, God Killer number one. Love this cover. I didn't realize it came in a bag, like a sensor bag, but that's a beautiful cover. Uh, God Killer number two, Geiger number six, uh, Future State number six. Awesome Rose Besh cover. Uh, Fantastic Four Life Story number four. Love this cover. This cover is awesome. Uh, the Thing number thirty-seven, like a trading card variant. Fantastic Four, number 37. I think that's a Terry Dotson cover. Looks kind of like his style. Uh, Dune, House of Trees, number 10. And Agony, don't know the number. Man, so many cool covers. Okay, uh, Fantastic Four, 32, Peach Moko cover. I must have grabbed this one multiple times. <laughs> I think that's the third one I have. Uh, Fantastic Four, number 36. Awesome cover. Dune, House of Trees, number 9. Dynamite Lives, number four. Uh, Detective 1045. Love that. Detective 1044. Love that cover. This artist that does these covers, these are just such cool covers. A uh, Detective 1043, another gorgeous cover. A uh, Dune House of Trees, number 10. Uh, Demon Days Cursed Web, number one variant. Uh, I feel like I got that one as well. Some of these I must have bought multiple times by mistake. Yeah, <laughs> these all look familiar to me. I think I ordered those in the last box. Uh, Orville number two, that's awesome. Uh, Orphan and the Five Beasts number three, James Stokey cover. Love the covers he does. Uh, NYX number four, awesome Rose Bish cover. Love that. 
Uh, number two, Rosebush cover. Love that as well. Ninjak number two, David Nakayama cover. That is awesome. Uh, Nine Stones, issue five. That's just a really nice cover. Awesome artwork. All right, next stack. We have uh, Nightwing 89. I really like all the covers on this series. This is also a girder cover. I'm a big fan of girder covers. Anytime there's like a building construction with a girder, big fan of that. Uh, oh, this is a cool cover, but I don't know what that is. Uh, Power Rangers, number 14. Awesome cover. Uh, Primordial, number four. That looks like a Michael Arwood cover. Uh, Radiant Black, issue 12. That's a nice cover. Uh, different version of number 12. Uh, Mirka and Delfo, Red Sonia cover. That's awesome. Love her artwork. Uh, different Red Sonia, different artists. Mirka and Delfo cover to Red Sonia number five. Uh, Red Sonia holiday special with a listener cover. That's cool. Uh, Red Sonia black, white, and red number five. I love all these black, white, and red covers they're doing lately for different series. Oh, a Jay Lee cover for black, white, and red. That is awesome. Another Jay Lee cover for number six. Uh, black, white, and red. Red Sonia number six. Another the variant of that. Uh, Rise of Jacula number one. That's a cool cover. Red Shift number one. A fun sci fi cover. Robin number 11. Robin Annual 2021. That's a beautiful cover. I love that. I love how the artists use the digital effect to give it depth. And this Hungry Earth reddens under snow clad hills issue one. <laughs> Big long name, but looks cool. Interior is kind of good. It's interesting. Okay, let me clear these out. We're getting kind of full here. Okay, next stack we have Scumbag number 11. That's a beautiful cover. Amazing Fantasy number two. That's a cool looking cover. Well, the interior is pretty cool too. Oh yeah, that's really nice. I love when you open up a comic book and the interior is just as fun as the cover. Different artist, but just a cool interior. Okay, I really like that. Uh, Amazing Fantasy number two, Peach Momoko variant. That's awesome. Arkham City, The Order of the World. That's a fun cover. Amazing Spider-Man 85, Peach Momoko variant. That's, I think I actually got a second copy of that. Uh, Amazing Spider-Man 875, a big thick issue for a dollar is awesome. Army of Darkness 1979, number two. That's a cool cover. Army of Darkness 1979, another Turtles homage cover. Love that. Avengers Tech on Avengers number one Peach Momoko variant. I think I got a couple of these actually. These are those two. I actually got duplicates by mistake. A uh, Barbarella number four. A uh, Batman eighty nine number two. Love this cover. That's an awesome cover. A uh, Batman one fifteen. That's a beautiful cover. Batman one fourteen. Love that cover. Super Sons number seven. A uh, Deathbird the trading card variant. Captain Marvel thirty seven Peach Momoko cover. Catwoman, number 36. Uh, okay. Catwoman, number 39. That's a cool cover. Canta 3, Lionhearted, number 4. Uh, ooh, this is upside down. Oh, okay. So this is Blade Runner Origins, a Peach Momoko cover. Black Widow, Peach Momoko cover. I feel like I got some of these already. Oh, and I got another. Okay. That's a third one. I didn't even realize I ordered three. Uh, Batman Adventure Continues Season 2, number 5. That cover is awesome. Love that cover. The Garter, number 1. That's cool. Uh, Batman Secret Files, The Garter, number 1. That's a cool cover. Uh, Demon Days Curse Web, number 1. Ah, I feel like I bought that one by mistake. You know, duplicate. Uh, Demon Days Cursed Web, number 1. Demon Days Curse Web, number 1. Another variant. Uh, Jane Free. Oh, right. This is cool because the other one I got was damaged. I was like a little bummed out about that, but this one's nice. So that's good. Uh, Demon Days Chris Webb, Peach Moko cover. All right. That's awesome. So in this case, it's good I got a duplicate. <laughs> I didn't realize I got so many duplicates. Okay. We have uh, Deathstroke Inc. number two. That cover's cool. Uh, Defenders number one. That's a fun cover. Uh, okay. Another duplicate. Deadpool Black, White, and Blood number three. Uh, Daredevil number 35. Deathstroke Inc. number one. That's a cool cover. I really like that one. Oh, Miss Marvel number one. That's a cool cover. I think. Yeah, this, I think this is a reprint of all her first appearances, but with like new artwork. I really like that. That one's nice. Uh, My Date with Monsters number two. Uh, Nightwing number 87. It's a beautiful cover. 
Uh, Miss Marvel, uh, I guess Beyond the Limit, number one. A really fun Peach Momoko cover. Love that. Miss Marvel, Beyond the Limit, number one. Uh, Moss, number six. I think this is the series with the, like, yeah, the photo interior. Uh, Sweet Paprika, number seven. Mighty Morphin, 14, Lee and Hip Cover. Mary Jane and Black Cat Beyond, number one. Uh, House of Slaughter, number one. Uh, Jay Lee cover, that's awesome. Love that one. Uh, okay, I love this cover. The Lady Mechanica, number one. Gorgeous cover. Uh, Lady Mechanica, number one. Different variant. A King's Vengeance, number one. That cover is really cool. Didn't realize how cool that was. The interior, the interior is pretty good, too. It's got kind of a fun, like, cartoony look to it. But the cover, I love that cover. Uh, King Conan, number one. A Stan Sakai cover. Love that. That's awesome. Uh, King Conan, number one. Cool, like, zombie cover. Killer Queens, number four. Love that cover. A uh, Kang the Conqueror, number five. Justice League Infinity, number seven. Justice League Incarnate, number one. That's a cool cover. Really like that one. Uh, Justice League, number 70. Beautiful cover. Joy Operations, number one. Uh, the Joker Annual. Uh, not sure the number, but I absolutely love this cover. This is one of my favorite covers from last year. Just an adorably fun cover. And then uh, Adventure Man, number seven. Looks like a Terry Dotson cover. Love that. That's awesome. And one more stack in this box. All right. We got Amazing Spider-Man, number 79. It looks like an Arthur Adams cover. Yeah, it's Arthur Adams. That's awesome. Uh, Amazing Spider-Man, number 80. That's a fun cover. Number 81. Uh, number 82. Uh, Order of the World, Arkham City, number... Uh, what number is that? Number four. Uh, Apex Legends over time number three. A David Nakayama cover. Love that. Uh, Arkham City. Oh, I got a duplicate of this. This cover is gorgeous, though. I love that cover. Such a great cover. Uh, Army of Darkness 1979, number four. Love that cover. Uh, a variant to that issue. Army of Darkness 1979, number four. A third variant. That's a cool cover. Uh, I guess a fourth. <laughs> Lots of variants on that cover. Love them, though. Okay, issue five. That's an awesome cover. Uh, Ant-Man, Infinity Saga, David Nakayama cover. That's amazing. And Avengers, Tech on Avengers, number six, Peach Momoko cover. I think that was a variant. Okay, so that box was awesome. There was a lot of really cool comic books there. All right, I'm ready to dig through box number five. Okay, next box. I am having so much fun with this video. This is one of my favorite videos I've done, I think, just because there's so many amazing covers. Uh, okay, Batman 89, number four. Awesome Babistar cover. Absolutely love this cover. Uh, Batman Annual 2 on E21. Cool cover. Batman Catwoman, number nine. That's a cool cover. Uh, let's see. Issue nine, a variant cover. That's a cool cover. Batman Fear State Omega, number one. Batman Adventures Continue, season two, number seven. Uh, Batman the Detective, number six. Batman Imposter was it book three? That's a cool looking cover. Batman Urban Legends number ten. Batman Urban Legends number eleven. Uh, Batman Urban Legends number twelve. Okay, let's see next deck. We have a really cool Black Manta cover number four. Uh, I guess one of these is a variant. Black Panther number one sketch variant. Uh, Bonier number one. That looks cool. Cool looking comic book. Uh, Bonier, number one, different variant. So we got three variants on that. Uh, Sensational She-Hulk, number one, Archer variant. That's cool. Sheena, number two, uh, Rose Bish cover. That's awesome. Sheena, number three, Rose Bish. Silk, number one, variant. Silk, number one, another variant. Uh, Sleeping Beauties, number eight. So Universal number 10, a J. Lee cover. Love that. Captain Harlock number one. That might be art term, not 100% sure. Uh, and then number three, I think that's a, a Derek Chu cover. And number six, yeah, I want the, all the variants to this series. That's cool. Uh, Spider Woman number 21, David Nakayama cover. Love that. Uh, Star Wars number 16, David Nakayama. I guess I got more than I thought I did, which is awesome. Stranger Things, Tomb of Yabuin, number two. And number two, cover B. 
Uh, number three, cover D. Suicide Squad, number 12. All right, it's going to take me a while to sort all these because there's nothing in order. They're just, I guess, by month they were listed. Uh, Joker, number 10, awesome punchline cover. Love that one. Batman 119, beautiful cover. 118, beautiful cover. Uh, Batgirls, number one, Lee and Hugh cover. Absolutely love this cover. I think that's such a gorgeous cover. Uh, Barbarella, number nine, I think. Uh, Derek Chu cover. Awesome cover. Number eight. I love this cover. That's a great cover. Uh, number seven. These are all Derek Chu. All awesome covers. Uh, number six. Not sure the artist on that one, but it's a cool cover. Number six, a different variant. Beautiful cover. Uh, number six, that's the Derek Chu cover. Love that one. Number five. Number five with the awesome Turtles homage cover. I love that they did Turtle homage covers on like pretty much every single series. Uh, number five, the Derek Chu cover. That one's awesome. I actually really want all these Derek Chu Barbarella covers. So for a buck a piece, I'm really happy to get all those. Okay. We got, uh, let's see, Hawkeye number one, Noto variant. That one's really nice. A Hawkeye number one. It's got a young variant. That's awesome. Uh, Stormbreakers. Not sure, but I love the cover with Pizza Dog. That one's awesome. Uh, Night Gwen. Not sure the number, but it's a David Nakayama cover. Love that. Uh, Hulk number one. That's a fun cover. Uh, Hulk number one. Peach from Oko cover. Love that cover. That's an awesome cover. Uh, Red Sonya number one. David Nakayama cover. Love that one. Inferno number three, Peach Momoko cover. Wow, this is a great pile here. Uh, Inferno number three, beautiful cover. Inferno number three, another beautiful cover. Number four, uh, number four variant, beautiful cover. Number four, I love this cover. That's a great cover. Uh, Invincible Red Sonya number six, another Turtles homage. That's awesome. Invincible Red Sonya number seven, the Lisner cover. Love that. Uh, Invincible Red Sonya number seven Frank Cho cover. All right, next stack. All right, I'm gonna really have to sort these because there's a lot more duplicates in here than I realized. <laughs> X Lies Over number one Peach Momoko cover. It's awesome cover though. I mean, like if I'm gonna have a lot of duplicates, Peach Momoko stuff duplicates, that's fine because you know that's awesome stuff. A uh, Wonder Woman Evolution number four, beautiful cover. World of Krypton number one. That's a cool cover. Joy Operations number one. That looks like a David Mack cover. Love that. Radiant Black number 10. That cover is awesome. Love that cover. Apex Legends Overtime number 4. David Nakayama cover. It's a homage to Secret Wars 4. Love that. That's awesome. Black Panther 2. Scotty Young cover. Uh, X-Men number 6. It's a selfie or a cell phone cover. I kind of like those. Uh, Green Lantern number 9. That's a really cool cover. really like that one. Uh, Green Lantern number 11. That's an awesome cover. Uh, Grim Universe. 2021 holiday special it's a cute cover cute and fun at the same time uh Gru and meets tarzan number four i think i got a duplicate of that <laughs> oh man like i said it's so laggy on the sites it's like oh that's cool hit that's cool hit you know you put it into the cart and then sometimes you're grabbing stuff by mistake and like i should be able to sell that but you know maybe for two or three dollars but it's not gonna be like an easy sell so it's not like i was would buy something like that three or four but i'm definitely grabbing it when i see it because i would definitely want it so i could see why i would get duplicates by mistake harbinger number two that's a cool cover harley queen number 10 uh harbinger number two i do want to get a lot of these newer valiant comic books so i'm actually glad i grabbed a bunch hawkeye number one that's fun a uh, harley queen number six love that cover okay let me clear these out we're getting a little bit full here okay next stack okay we have Wonder Girl number five, that's a great cover. Uh, Wonder Girl number seven, that's an awesome cover. Love that one. A uh, Wonder Woman 784, Terry Dotson cover. A uh, Wonder Woman 784, love that cover. Wonder Woman Annual 2021. Uh, Wonder Woman Annual 2021, that's a beautiful cover. Rainy Black number 10. Is it a black? I guess it's, oh, the whole interior is black light. Oh, this is neat. It's a whole black light comic book. Oh, that is cool. Oh, and I grabbed a, oh no, okay. So it's different printings of it, I think. Cause one is like black and one is pink. All right, those are cool. Black Panther number one, gorgeous cover. A uh, Catwoman 40, uh, Jenny Friesen cover. Batman Catwoman special one. Black Widow uh, number 54. 
Silver Surfer Rebirth number one, Peach Momoko cover. Love that one. Radiant Black number 11. That's awesome. Radiant Black 11, different variant. Okay, next stack. I gotta move that over a little bit. We have Superman and Son, Ocal L number six, a Lee and Yuk cover. Love that. Swamp Thing number 10. That's cool. Superman Red and Blue number three, Dark Two cover. Trover Saves the Universe, a Rick and Morty comic book number five. Titans United number five. That looks like a uh, Dark Two cover, I believe. Awesome cover. Yusugi Jimbo number 24. Love that. Uh, number 25. Also love that. Number one. That's awesome. Unholy Vampirella Dracula, a love story. Rose Bish cover. Love that. That's awesome. Uh, and uh, number two. That looks like an art germ variant. Uh, Wastelander Star Lord number one. Uh, Warhammer number four. It's a cool looking cover. Vengeance of Vampirella, a uh, Spider Man 300 homage, like that. Uh, Vengeance of Vampirella number 25. Vampirella Purgatory issue four. That might be a Dark Two, not sure. Uh, Wolverine number 19. That's actually a really cool looking cover. Love that one a lot. I don't think there's a cover here that I don't love. <laughs> That's because I was just picking out stuff by the cover. I was picking out stuff I wanted that I thought had awesome covers. Uh, Future State Superman versus Imperialist Lex 3. David Nakayama cover. That's amazing. Geiger 1 blank cover. That's really neat. Uh, Gotham City Villains number 1. Painted cover. Love that. Green Lantern number 9. Uh, oh, I don't know what series. Oh, a thing called Truth. Really like the cover. That one's fun. Interior's nice too. That's a cool looking comic book. And then uh, cover B. And then uh, issue three. Uh, Teen Titans Academy number eight. Uh, the Thing number two. Love the Thing. Okay, next stack we have Detective Comics 1052. Uh, Villains for Hire number three. An awesome David Nakayama cover. Love that one. That one's amazing. Uh, Dune House of Atreides number 12. It's an awesome looking cover. 12, a different variant. Electra Black, White, and Blood number 1. I think that's a Mirka and Dalfa cover. That's gorgeous. Uh, Eat the Rich number 5. Excalibur number 26. Fantastic Four number 38. Terry Dotson cover. Fathom the Core number 2. I do like the uh, you know, water covers are some of my favorites. Uh, Fight Girls number 5, Frank Cho, uh, Sabine Rich Colored. Uh, Future State Gotham 2, a Derek 2 cover. Future State Suicide Squad 2, a Derek 2 cover. Love that one. Might accidentally bought those both two times. Oh, this is cool. We have a Black Bolt cover. Love Black Bolt. Uh, Doctor Strange number 3, a Lee and Hugh cover. Love that one. That one's awesome. A White Fox number 1, Peach Moko cover. Love that cover. Uh, Defenders number five, Michael Howard cover. I love that one too. Detective Comics 1046. That's a cool cover. Uh, 1047, another awesome cover. Uh, 1048, love that cover. 1053, another awesome cover. These are all awesome covers. And 1048, love those covers. Okay, next we have Buckhead number two. I like the colors and composition of this cover. That's a cool cover. Side's pretty nice looking too. Uh, Buffy the Vampire Slayer, number 33. Beautiful cover. Really like that cover. What a color. Awesome, awesome. By the Horns, number 8. That's a cool cover. Uh, Catwoman, 38. Cowboy Bebop, number 1. Art Drum cover, love that. And then in color, Art Drum cover. Those are both amazing. Uh, Chicken Devil, number 3. Catwoman, number 39. Daredevil, number 36. A Dark Knights of Steel, number four. Awesome cover. Love that cover. Is that Joshua Middleton cover? I kind of feel like it is. It kind of looks like his style. Uh, okay, and then we have Stranger Things, number three. I like Stranger Things. These, I mean, the covers aren't super awesome on these, but I just like Stranger Things, so I'm grabbing them because they're Stranger Things. Some of the covers are kind of cool, though. And, uh, you know what? I might have a few of those already. A uh, Suicide Squad... King Shark number four. Love that cover. Uh, number four, the regular cover. Supergirl, Woman of Tomorrow number eight. That's a really pretty cover. I like the artwork. The interior is pretty nice too. Yeah, that's cool. I like that a lot. Uh, Supergirl, Woman of Tomorrow number eight. 
Uh, number seven. That's a beautiful cover. Really like that cover, actually. Yeah, these are nice. Uh, number seven. That's a beautiful cover, too. Number six. That cover, uh, a little bit weaker. But I still like it. A Suicide Squad, King Shark, number five. That's, um, what is that? It's Sia Ohm cover. I do like that artist. Uh, Bonier the Aromatic, number one. A blank cover. And Bountiful Garden, number five. I like that cover a lot. It's the cover. Oh, yeah, the interior is really nice, too. I really like that. All right, that's a cool-looking comic book. And that's it for that box. That box was a lot of fun. Let's dig through box number six. All right, next box. Man, there hasn't been a bad box yet. These are all so much fun to me. Okay, so we have Mercy number six. I really like that cover. I like the colors on that cover. Uh, Malt's number one. So this is the same. Yeah, it looks like photos inside pretty much. <laughs> uh, okay, the next Batman, second son number two. Non-stop Spider-Man number one. I think that's a David Finch cover. A non-stop Spider-Man number one. I think that's an Alex Ross cover. Uh, congratulations, Handle of Care. This is... Oh, uh, this is just a die-cut cover. This, uh, I want to look inside. Yeah, that's a cool comic book. Really happy with that. Non-stop Spider-Man 1 variant. Uh, Miles Morales, Spider-Man number 32. That's cool. Uh, number 28. Uh, number 27, the Rose Bish cover. Love that one. Uh, number 27, Marvel Action Spider-Man. I do like these kids' comic books because I always say this is the stuff that gets beat up, so it's hard to find them later on in good shape. So I'll grab those. You know, I'll, For a dollar, I'll grab them just to have them. Uh, Giant Size Amazing Spider-Man number one. Number one, so there's two different variants of that. So the Spidey comic books is mostly just grabbing because they're Spider-Man comic books. You don't really see those as often in dollar bins. So I'll grab them just to fill in the collection. Uh, Red Sonia, number 28, awesome J. Lee cover. Red Sonia, the Superpowers 3, Lisner cover. Uh, Venom 34, a fun sideways cover. Do you like sideways covers? Uh, Venom 34. Venom 25, a sideways cover. That one's cool. Uh, Voices Legacy, number one. That's an awesome cover. Uh, different variant of number one. $10 cover price on that one. So that's great for a dollar. MFKZ number one. That's a cool cover. A Mighty Morphin E. Ali and Yuck cover. Mars Morales Spider-Man 27. A Rose Bush cover. I think that's a duplicate. A Mercy number six. A Merca and Delpha cover. That's cool. Okay, next stack. We have the Nuclear Family number one. That's a cool cover. I really like that. Orcs number four. Really like all the Orcs artwork and the interior artwork. It's fun. I gotta read this series because I enjoy it every time I see it. Number four, a different variant. Number five, awesome cover. Number five, a different variant. Planet Size X Men, number one. That's a cool cover. A Power Rangers five with a blank cover. Project Patron, number three. That's a cool cover. Radiant Black, number four. Love that. Uh, Red Room, number two. Super happy to have that. Uh, Red Sonia number 22, Lisner cover. Red Sonia, the superpowers, number 5. Red Sonia 25, the uh, J. Lee cover. Number 26, the J. Lee cover. Love those. Oh, that one's upside down. Uh, Red Sonia number 27. Oh, no, that one's upside down. And uh, another 27, different variant. Okay, next stack we have Star Wars Bounty Hunter. Uh, what number is that? Just Alpha. Uh, Star Wars Bounty Hunters number one. I think that's a Babs Tar cover. That's actually really cool. I wanted that issue. And uh, number one variant. Number one. Another variant. Uh, Spider Woman number 12. Number 10. Uh, Spider Man. Spider Shadow number one variant. Captain Harlock number one. Captain Harlock one. A different variant. Number one. Another variant. Vampirella number 20. Uh, what series is that? That's a cool cover though. The Unkindness of Ravens number 5. Cool cover. Uh, Thanos Quest number 1. That's a big thick issue. So I guess that reprints those two. That is cool. Uh, Teen Titans Academy number 3. That's a nice cover. Uh, Teen Titans Academy number 1. 
Tankers number two, that's awesome cover. Uh, Tarna from Heavy Metal number three, that's fun. Symbiote Spider Man number five, number four. Superman Red and Blue, uh, John Romita Jr. cover. Superman and Blue number three, a Derek Two cover. I think I actually got two of those. Okay, next stack we have the Mortal Hulk number one, a variant edition. Uh, number one, Flatline. Uh, number 47, number 47, a different variant. Number 46, a homage cover, that's cool. Number 46, beautiful cover. Number 44, number 44. Ice Cream Man, number 24, love that cover. Uh, Hollow Heart, number one, that's a really creepy, awesome cover. Love that one. Uh, ooh, got a duplicate of that. <laughs> uh, Stormbreakers. Uh, I guess Heroes Reborn number one. That's a cool cover. Really like that one. Uh, Helm Grey Castle number one. That's a cool cover. Hellions number 11. Uh, Superman Red and Blue. Uh, Superman 32 Lee Hing Hyuk cover. Love that. Superman 31 Lee Hing Hyuk cover. Strange Adventures number nine. Strange Adventures nine. Different variant. Strange Academy number 10. Arthur Adams cover. Love that. Strange Academy number 10. Different version. Uh, Bounty Hunters Alpha Second Print. Okay, let me clear these out because I'm running out of space. All right, next stack we have the Amazing Spider Man number 77, Green Goblin, the training card cover. Love that. Uh, 76, Stormbreakers, uh, number 75. No, it's Amazing Spider Man number 75. Uh, number 74, Amazing Spider Man 72, Lee New cover. Love that cover. Number 62, uh, Iron Man 2020, number 6 variant. Uh, Infinite Frontier, number 0. That's a fun cover. Number 0, a different variant. like that cover a lot. Mortal Hulk 1 variant. All right, next stack we have uh, Symbiote Spider-Man, number 4. Web of Spider-Man 3 variant edition. The cover with uh, Devil Dinosaur, that's a duplicate. Oh, that's a duplicate too. I must have grabbed a couple of those by mistake. Uh, Crossroads number one, Spider Man, Spider Shadow number five, Noto cover, that's cool. Another Noto cover, number four, number three, those are all beautiful. Uh, oh, I grabbed a couple of those by mistake. Uh, another Noto cover, that's gorgeous. All these Noto covers are really nice. I really like all those. A uh, non stop Spider Man five, three, Dark Hold Spider Man number one. Amazing Spider-Man, Arthur Adams cover, that's awesome. Number 84, number 82, number 81, number 80, I think that's a duplicate. Uh, number 79, Arthur Adams cover, that's also a duplicate. Uh, number 78. Okay, we have uh, Amazing Spider-Man, number 75, Arthur Adams cover, that's awesome. Uh, Hobgoblin trading card cover, Spider-Man 74. Uh, Miles Morales Spider-Man, number 31. Number 30, Amazing Spider-Man 72, Mars Morales 33, number 30, Web of Spider-Man number 5, number 4, number 3. Alright, this is the very Spider-Man heavy box. Uh, Captain Harlock number 4. Really happy I got so many of these because I really wanted to get a full set of all of them. I love all those covers. A Sony Universal number seven, awesome J Lee cover. And number eight, another J Lee cover. And number nine, J Lee. Love J Lee covers. A Save Yourself number four. That's a beautiful cover. RWBY number seven. A Sleeping Beauties number seven. Really like that cover. Something is Killing the Children number 19. A Sheena number one, Rose Bish cover. Love that. Robin number seven. Love that cover too. Uh, Robin number six. Um, What's his name? Was it Francis Monopool cover? I, I think that's the artist's name. I forget. Beautiful cover, though. I love that cover. So, uh, Reptile number four. That's a beautiful cover. Darkhold Spider Man number one. Uh, Darkhold Spider Man number one. Different variant. Wow, this is a huge, huge, huge dollar bin haul. I'm getting really tired. <laughs> I'm losing my voice. Okay, last stack from this box. We have. Red Sonia number three, Amerka and Delpho cover. Just a beautiful cover. Man, interiors are beautiful too. What an awesome comic book. Uh, Red Sonia number three, a Lisner cover. 
Red Sonja number two, uh, lyrics, lyrics cover. Is that how you say that name? All right. Beautiful cover, though. I love that cover. Uh, Red Sonja number two. Red Sonja number two. The I believe that's the Mercon Dalfo cover. Uh, Lisner cover of Red Sonja number two. Red Sonja number two. So I guess one's a black and white variant, one's the regular variant. Those are gorgeous. Number one. Number one, Lisner cover. Uh, number one, that's a beautiful cover. Wow, these are all awesome covers. Uh, the Merca and Delfo cover, that's awesome. I, uh, oh, okay, they're two different prints because one is red and one's blue. A Reckoning War, number one, a Peach Momoko cover. That is awesome. A Radiant Black, number nine. Uh, okay, so this one I actually paid the full price, whichever, yeah, $10. So I bought this for cover price. It's the multiverse role-playing game with this beautiful, adorable Peach Momoko cover. I had to have this one. Even though it was 10 bucks and not a dollar, I was like, I'm going to get that. Because I love Peach Momoko, and I just love that cover so much. Uh, Miles Morales Annual number 1. Captain Harlock number 5. Love that cover. Captain Harlock number 5. Different variant. Love it. Uh, Captain Harlock. Not sure the number, but it's got Queen Esmeralda on it. That's cool. Love that one. Captain Harlock number 4. Oh, well, those are cool. All right, so that's everything in that box. That box at the end there was amazing. All right, let's see what's in box number seven. Final box. Okay, we have uh, Skybound X number four. That's uh, that's a really nice cover. I like that cover a lot. Uh, number five, David Finch cover. Uh, number five, a different variant. Uh, Geiger number three, second printing. Geiger number four. Geiger four, different cover a third variant a fourth variant geiger five geiger five a second variant a third variant a fourth variant really happy to get all those i really want a full set of all the geiger issues um okay let's see we have oops let me move that over a little bit gung-ho anger number three that's a really nice cover i wonder if the interiors oh the interiors are beautiful they're like painted Wow, this looks cool. I really want to check that out. Uh, Harley Quinn 6. I think I ordered two of those by mistake. <laughs> Mortal Hulk 48. 48 variant. Uh, 48 Peach Momoko cover. 49. That cover is awesome. Oh, this is cool. So the other one I bought was damaged. I was a little bummed about that. But this one looks good. So I actually bought a second one. But this one's in nice shape. So I'm happy about that. Uh, Green Lantern 5. A fun Suicide Squad cover. A uh, God Killer number one. Love the cover so much on this. Oh, and the interiors are pretty cool too. All right, that's a cool comic book. Uh, Aliens Aftermath number one. Number one variant. Amazing Fantasy number one. That's a beautiful cover. Really beautiful cover. Oh, and the interiors are fine. Oh, yeah, I forgot. This is the anthology series with a whole bunch of different artists in it. That is cool. Really happy with that. America Chavez Made in USA number four. Uh, Save Yourself, number three. Number one. Uh, Savage Avengers, number 22. Uh, Skybound X, number one. Blank cover. Again, I'm grabbing these because it's the first appearance of Clementine. Kind of hoarding onto them. Oh, and then we have a whole bunch more. So yeah, I just grabbed a ton. I think I got like 10 of each color, if I remember correctly. Uh, and then this is the one with Clementine's actually on the cover. So I think that one will end up having more value. That one, I think I can only get one if I remember correctly. Uh, and then number three. It's a nice cover. I really like that cover. Terrier looks nice too. Cool looking comic book. Really enjoy that. Oh yeah, it's Arthur Adams. I thought it was Arthur Adams. That's a beautiful cover. Number three variant. Number four. Uh, number five. Uh, oh, Mom number one, the Jen Bartel cover. Uh, Magic number three, a blank cover. Okay, next stack, we have Magic number five, a blank cover. Uh, Marauders number 22, that's a beautiful cover. Love that cover. Uh, oh, I accidentally got that one the second time. MFKZ number two, that's a fun cover. Really like that one. Uh, Masters of the Universe number one. The Lunar Ladies number one, and just a cute, cute cover. Oh, the interior is fun, too. I like the interior. That's cool. Uh, Barbarella. Not sure the number, but that's a cool cover. America Chavez, number five variant. 
a uh, Hulk number one Peach Momoko cover. That's a duplicate. Oh, and this is a duplicate too. <laughs> I don't mind overbuying Peach Momoko stuff though, because it's good stuff. Uh, Mortal Hulk number 50, Jen Bartel cover. That's awesome. Uh, Inferno number three, Peach Momoko cover. Number two, Peach Momoko cover. Uh, number one, Peach Momoko cover. Those are awesome. Batman 110, awesome cover. Is that a jock cover? Yeah. Uh, Department of Truth number 11. That's a creepy cool cover. Detective 1041. All right, I'm going to clear these out because I'm running out of space. Okay, next. Okay, we have uh, Detective 1042. Uh, the Dreaming Waking Hours. That's a really pretty cover. I like the color to it. Oh, interior is pretty cool too. You know, it's a pretty nice color. Interior artwork, really nice. Oh, okay, uh, Eve number three. I'm losing my brain because I'm just really tired. So this is uh, V.E. Schwar Extraordinary. Interesting looking cover. Gorgeous cover. Uh, Future State Gotham number four. Number four. Those are probably connecting variants, I'm guessing. They look like, yeah, connecting. That's pretty awesome. I love connecting covers. Uh, Gamma Flight 2. It's got a young cover. Gamma Flight 3. Uh, Future State Gotham 3 Rose Bush cover. Love that. Uh, the Joker 5. Absolutely love this cover. I have this in a 9.8 graded, but you know, having another one is fine. I probably have a couple actually. <laughs> Legend of Dark Knight 3. Awesome cover. Uh, Carmen number 5. Justice League Last Ride 3. Justice League Last Ride 3. Different variant. Justice League 66. Okay, next stack. Let me scooch that over. Uh, it's a virgin variant. Not sure what it is. Uh, Lighthouse. Something like that. I don't know. That cover is really awesome though. Oh, the interior is awesome too. Oh, this looks like a fun sci-fi story. Oh, that's really cool looking. Like that. Uh, Lighthouse number three. Uh, Joker presents a puzzle book issue one. That's a fun cover. MFKZ number three. That looks cool. Number three, different variant. A Batman 111, a Suicide Squad variant. Batman 111, beautiful cover. Uh, Fortnite, number six. Batman Secret Files, Huntress, number one. That's an awesome cover. American Chavez, number five. Uh, She-Hulk, number two, David Nakayama variant. Black Widow, 13. I believe that's an Adam Hughes cover. Not sure the number. I think that's an Adam Hughes cover. Uh, Tis the Season to Be Freezing, number one, David Nakayama cover. Obi-Wan, number one, a Peach Momoko cover. Uh, Step by Bloody Step, number two. Absolutely love this cover. Uh, Peach Momoko cover. Uh, Silk, number one, a Jen Bartel cover. Uh, Robin, four, a Jen Bartel cover. Love that cover. Uh, New Mutants, 24, Peach Momoko cover. Uh, I think I actually bought that one by mistake. A second one. That's cool, though. Uh, Mighty Valkyries, number two, Peach Momoko. Mary Jane and Black Cat Beyond, number one, Peach Momoko. Love that cover. That's a cute cover. Uh, Eero Psyche, number four. Uh, that's a cool-looking comic book. Next deck. Lots of Peach Momoko in this haul. Uh, Kazar, number one, Peach Momoko variant. Storyteller, Trickster, uh, number four, Peach Momoko. That one, I might have paid $2 for. Like, a couple of these Peach Momokos might have been 2 Inferno number four, love that cover. Actually, I bought a duplicate though. Inferno uh, number four, Peach Momoko. Uh, Wastelanders Black Widow number one. That's a cool cover. A uh, Wonder Girl five, a uh, Jenny Friesen cover. Love that cover. A uh, Wonder Woman Black and Gold number one, a uh, Jen Bartel cover. Love that. Exit Sword fifteen, Peach Momoko cover. Uh, Trial of Magneto number three, Peach Momoko cover. Love this cover. That's a duplicate though. Oh, and Silver Surfer Rebirth number one, duplicate. Lots of duplicate. Oh, duplicate. <laughs> I'm okay with duplicates, though, because these are amazing. Amazing Spider-Man number 74. Love that cover. Uh, Jen Bartel cover to uh, Trial of the Amazons number one. It's a, you know, fold-out cover. Gorgeous cover. Love that. A uh, Catwoman 36. Jenny Friesen cover. And then the final stack of this haul. We have RWBY Justice League 5. That's a cute cover. Uh, number 5, a different variant. Uh, I think it's a Marco and Doubtful cover. Uh, look. Interiors are cute. I like that. That's awesome. Uh, this also looks like a Marco and Doubtful cover. That's awesome. Number four. 
Uh, oh, I think, is this Mark Van Alpha 2? I think so. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, that is cool. Didn't realize she did one of the Captain Harlock covers. That might be a Yoon cover. Not sure the artist. Really awesome cover, though. A uh, Captain Harlock number two. Uh, Captain Harlock. I'm not sure the number, but that's cool. Uh, Infinite Frontier number two. Love that cover. Frank Cho, Red Sonia cover. Uh, the Joker number six, a Suicide Squad variant. Joker number six, a Terry Dotson cover. Love that. Joker presents a puzzle box issue one. That's an awesome cover. Venom number one, Peach Momoko cover. A oh, Voyage to the Stars number four. Love it's like a Star Wars homage. Awesome Peach Momoko cover. Love that cover. All right, wow, awesome comic books in that box. Woo, I had a ton of fun going through an online dollar bin sale. I just cannot believe all the cool comic books I got for a dollar. I cannot wait till the next sale because I'm going to go even more crazy next time, I think. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.